Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Abby if you're new here, or if you're not, welcome back. Um, so today's haul is going to be really small. I just have three items to show you guys that I've collected over like the last uh, month or so, and they are all uh, like sweaters slash outer outerwear, um, if that interests you. Um, everything will be linked in the description uh, if you want to look at it on the website, uh, and I will list like the color and size that I bought, etc. Um, they are affiliate links, so if you do shop through them, it does really help support me. Uh, my <laughs> affiliate links for my last video uh, did not work. Uh, they led people to like um, a Lululemon like offline thing, so I'm really sorry about that. It was because I needed to install an update. Uh, it shouldn't happen again though. Um, yeah, uh, looking a little bit disheveled today. <laughs> I did not feel like really doing my hair and makeup so I look a little bit gross as I do in all of my videos. Uh, someday I promise I'll actually get ready for one of my videos and look nice but today's not the day so. Okay so the first thing that I'm showing you guys is the uh, scuba full zip um, in extra small small. Uh, this is in like a speckled black aka like kind of like a charcoal gray and then it has um, a black zipper. Um, I really like this because it's a great basic, um, it can pair with a lot of my different legging colors and I still think these look cute with jeans. Um, I love that you can wear them unzipped or zipped, um, I'm not, yeah, that's all I really have to say about them because if you look at some of my other videos, I've already reviewed this in True Navy and Dusky Lavender, um, but on the Canadian site anyways, this is fully in stock, so if you want a full zip and you don't have one, you should be able to buy this one. Um, I don't actually know about uh, the US site though, so you'll have to check that out. So the second thing I have to show you um, is this hooded defined jacket. Um, I'm trying to think of the color of this. Something gold. <laughs> I don't remember. I'll put it in the, the description. Um, but it's kind of like a yellowish green, which I know not a lot of people like, but is a little bit more on the gold side than um, uh, some other colors. Sorry, my cat's here. <laughs> she got surgery two days ago, so she's being very needy. Um, the hooded define is a little bit um, less thick than the regular define. Like I find it less structured almost, um, but it is very comfortable. I think it's made of Nulu, which is what our lines are made of. Yeah, it's Nulu. Um, it still has the thumb holes and the um, things that go over your hand like mittens. So if you wear it like outside running in the fall or the winter, uh, and it has a hood, which is nice. Um, this is in a size four. Uh, I'm extremely bloated right now, so it probably looks quite fitted on me, but I don't usually look like that. Uh, so I would say uh, stick to your true size for this one. Okay, so the third thing I'm showing you guys is actually outerwear. Um, it's the Down Fort All Jacket. Um, I'm trying to find the front. Oh, here's the back. It has a little bit of like this like classic Lululemon curve here and it has pockets. Uh, it's lined and water resistant. Uh, definitely seems like it'll be super warm. Um, I got it in a size 4 and showed me wearing it with the Define jacket underneath it so you can see what it looks like with the jacket under it. Um, it is fitted, so I would say that if you want to wear like a big hoodie under it to size up, uh, I bought this in my true size which is a size 4, but if I was planning on wearing this with like um, a scuba hoodie under it or something, I would probably have gotten the 6, but for now I am happy with the 4. Um, this is actually 
um, an okay price considering how warm I think it's going to be. Um, it was $198. Um, normally I wouldn't buy something this expensive for myself, but my husband bought it for me for my birthday, which was last week. Um, what else can I say about it? Other than I think it's really good quality, um, and I will probably wear it for, um, fall runs or winter runs, um, golfing in the fall when it's windy. <laughs> it's also wind resistant, actually, so you can wear it as a windbreaker, too. Um, let's see what else. It's made for mid-warmth, uh, and it's made with responsibly sourced down, which I really like because, um, I really don't like when animal products are used to make coats like um canada goose jackets and stuff like that um it has a removable hood i actually didn't know this so this hood does come off oh yeah there's a zipper there that's a really nice feature uh it has thumb holes which i think i showed in the try on um and it has zippered pockets so you can put your phone in it um reflective details so you can wear it running at night and oh it's made of a breathable fabric so you can sweat in it and not feel too stuffy um other than that i think that's all i really have to say about that one but if you have any questions please feel free feel free to let me know in the comments Okay, so the last thing I'm showing you guys is the Airwrap hoodie. Um, this one came out a couple weeks ago, and this is an autumn red. Um, I actually got this in a size 6 so that I could get a bit more of an oversized look. Um, here it is. And, as you might notice in the name when I link it down below, this is actually made of modal uh, and not the spacer fabric. So if you think of the Airwrap hoodie, you probably think of spacer fabric, which is like uh slippery kind of foamy feeling it's very different i'll put it that way kind of like spongy um and this is made of modal which is what like the soft ambitions is made out of and the new perfectly oversized crop crew um so it's very very soft uh and breathable on the inside so the inside is like this so it's great for working out in uh, and i just find it looks like you could wear it a bit more casually compared to the other one because the other one was spacer fabric so it did look a little more like athletic compared to athleisure and um, this one looks more athleisure to me i love the color it's like what could i compare it to a reddish orange um that's very bright and beautiful perfect for fall um i'm just noticing a stain on the hood I haven't worn this yet, and this, I don't know what that is. Anyways, <laughs> I'll just forget about that. But yeah, I actually highly recommend this. Nobody has talked about it really on like the Reddit page or anything where I follow Lululemon things, but I do really recommend this if you like Modal and you liked the look of the Spacer hoodie but didn't necessarily like the fabric, um, then this would be for you. And it is a great fall color, which is awesome. So that's actually it for this video. That's all I have to show you guys. I realized it was actually four things and not three uh, because I did forget that my husband bought me that jacket because I haven't worn it yet because it's still been uh, like at least 20 degrees every day where I am. Um, but yeah, uh, everything will be linked in the description. Please feel free to shop through my links as it does help me out, but do not feel obligated. If you do have any problems accessing um, the items through the links, just let me know and I'll do my best to fix it. Um, but yeah, other than that, uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.